welcome to organic city farm where you can actually live off the land. Let's go through so you can see for yourself. All right, inside, as you can see, we've got uh, three meter ceilings. We have beautiful burnish concrete flooring. And if you're wondering what these little caps is, it's actually PowerPoints because the way this has been designed is that everything is interchangeable. We have a kitchen here. You can modify it if you like. The only thing that's actually been fixed is the sink. Uh, which is a beautiful double copper sink. These two ovens are NIF ovens, so high-end, self-cleaning. One of them is even a steamer, I believe. Now, the next thing I want to show you is a butler's pantry because everything's kind of been hidden away. We got a um, dishwasher in here, we got another one here, and in here, we actually got a fridge, which could also be converted into a freezer if that's your preference. As you can see, you've got lots of storage available here. These doors used to be the floorboards in the original home this is from the original home as well and you've got a quite spacious living space over here we've got big ass fans here there's no aircon in here because it's not needed it's passive passive soul if i can say it starting look over here you can get your work done there's lots of light and let's go out and have a look at the roof terrace so you can see this absolutely stunning garden we have electric louvers on top as well, so you can have the right uh, amount of light. Let's see if we can turn them on. I have, oh, there we go. As you can see, close it, open it, just what you want, depending on if it's summer, if it's winter, what it is. All right, so next thing I want to show you is down here, which is the living quarter. We're now down at the ground floor. You've got direct access to the storage and the garage in here behind this beautiful upcycle um, jar door. You've got obviously sliding doors through. This is the first of the two bedrooms. As you can see, high ceilings. We're looking at 2.7 meters. And nice little detail in here. I don't know if, sorry, I'm turning around, but just, you can see there's a bit of light in there in, in the walk-in, uh, sorry, building robes. Now, this is an absolutely stunner of a bathroom. Just look at that up there. We've got beautiful shower, and if we can open these up. It is a bit windy today, so we're gonna be a little bit careful, but you got to, you can set yourself up for a beautiful garden out here. We'll close that again. And then I'll show you the other bedrooms. Um, there's just lots of little bits and pieces in here. You've got my like motion center in here. You've got toilet in there. We'll turn that off again. Come through here. As you can see, big fans in the ceiling, lots of space room to put building robes if that's what you want to do. And again, sliding doors coming through here. And we're back in the hallway. You've got motion sensors here. If you do need to get up during the night, there's motion sensors off through the staircase. Next, we're just going to go outside. And I'm going to show you this magnificent working farm. This is completely future proof. For instance, there's no painting required here. Everything exposed and outside it is no different. If you look at the, the driveway, this is all gravel, but what is sitting underneath is this diamond system. And what it does, it lets the moisture come through so you don't have to worry about concrete and cracking down the track and stuff like that. It is going, and that also means that you can park probably about six cars here if that's what you want. And you've got plenty of space. Now, let's just look at the garden. Uh, as you can see, you've got some purple pipes. That's the gray water system. So your washing machine, your shower, etc. There's also two 5,000 litre water tanks in here that can help service the rest of the garden. It is connected to the main. One thing I forgot to say inside, by the way, is that obviously we've got solar panels up on the roof. We've got three phase. So if you want to have an electric car down the track or you want a solar battery, it is prepared for it. Now, I'm, just, I'm not going to show you the entire garden because we're going to be here for a couple of years, but I just want to show you this fruit here. That is like super impressive. Now, my clients is already living off land. They get two meals a day from this ongoing, sustainable, organic garden. There is everything in here. So for instance, over here we have the greenhouse for the seed stations for your future <laughs> meals. You have the big orchard in here. You will see there are some chickens in there. There's some beehives in there. There's actually three um, chicken runs. We have over here, oh, 
forgot this. I'm gonna show this. Look at that hand grenade. That is edible at some point. In here, this is actually a whole dock run. You've got a cubby house in here where you can put um, your tools, etc. And you've got more, you've got chili down here, you've got olives down behind me. And then we've got this outdoor kitchen facility. We've got the fire going, you've got everything that you want here. This is permaculture. And the best part of this is that we're in the middle of East Fremantle. You, this is a working city farm where you can live off the land. And that is priceless. If you'd like to know more, do get in touch so you don't miss out on this one in a lifetime opportunity to live the life that you deserve to live. Thank you for watching.